in the tri state this morning. It's feeling more like winter as we made a big, big transition. Yeah, waking up this morning in the 40s, Jen. Let's just go for fall. Like, this is what it is supposed to be like on these fall mornings. We sometimes dip into the upper 30s. You get that chill to the air. And look at this right now in Warren County 39 in Springboro, 38 in Loveland, and 38 for Morrow. Reading is starting the day at 43 degrees and even Mount Healthy. Uh, it's kind of tipping there to the 40 degree mark. Now, what does it feel like outside? It feels like 37. There is a wind chill in Connersville and Brookville. Wilmington's at 39. You'll also though notice there are a lot of spots that don't have a number listed, and that's because there's no wind there. So no wind chill. It's a good thing to be left out this morning. Temperatures today are going to warm up pretty quickly, though, with that sunshine back in the sky and that just Beautiful, almost it almost looks fake, doesn't it? Like it's that vibrant of a blue. So we love in fall. By noon, we're up to about 64. By one o'clock, we'll be at 65, and then we're going to top out today at 68 degrees. It's within the realm of normal for this time of year, and just a beautiful, absolutely beautiful today. Day tonight, we're down to about the mid 40s, so a touch higher on that temperature. The outlying areas, though, still we could see some probably low 40s and upper 30s. The sky is clear, but tonight the wind is shifting to the southwest, and this is going to help bring in a little more heat. We're not talking anything major here, but on Tuesday, your high does go up to around the 70 degree mark. Wednesday, we're up to 72 degrees. So even notice those overnight temperatures start to increase here just a little bit. Now the Wednesday rain chance I have late there on the descriptor. What does that mean though? Well, it's not even like late in the afternoon or in the evening. This is actually more of an overnight chance for rain coming in after midnight. So if you're thinking about your Wednesday afternoon activities, you're good. Actually, it looks like we'll have a lot of sunshine that day before that rain chance comes in. Now, what does this rain chance look like, though? We're going to go back to future view here just for a second because I want to show you just the the structure of this one. So you've got a cold front coming through overnight by early Thursday morning. We will see the potential for rain around, but notice that this front just is not doing a lot and it'll be out. So even that Thursday rain chance is really more for just the morning hours and then getting out of here pretty quickly and not being a huge issue. But I will tell you this, while this cold front doesn't do a lot when it comes to rain, not strong storms this time, it will definitely cool us down again. So the warmest we'll see this week is that Wednesday forecast at 72 degrees. Then we're going to dip back down to highs in the low 60s for Friday and Saturday and Sunday. Those are more of the temperatures we see in November, so that's kind of tipping us a little bit ahead of normal. But the next week we will see that temperature coming up just a little bit. So warmest on the nine day is Wednesday, the coldest Sunday morning. Again, kind of like this past weekend. Sunday was our coldest morning. This Sunday as well will be in the low 40s and upper 30s here across the Ohio Valley.